so one of the things, I think the flute part, for example, is really cool. Yes. And, and you want uh, the high notes to be... You want the high notes to come out, the right. Texture, so, yeah. so in the thing is, she's in a place where she could probably give a little bit more, but not much. So what is the thing that you could do that the composer has not done that would help? Um, probably bring down the clarinet. Well, maybe bring down the clarinet, I'll also yeah. bring down the strings, but he's written three Fs. So here we're in front of a problem, and this is the thing that you do when you, in making a recording where you do EQ, where you carve holes. You make space for everybody to play in. So you do the sort of thing where it's, again, like with toddlers, you get the thing. If they're all crowded into the same place, there's going to be fights and fits, and everybody's going to be trying to take the same toys. If you say, hey, why don't you come over here to the box? Hey, why don't you do this? So why don't, why don't, metaphorically speaking, you say, when you go lower, just play a little bit softer so there's kind of this hairpin thing going on for the clarinets and the, and the strings, and then really nail the accents. This will already, when you look at where she plays, this will mean that that one's slightly covered. This one will come through well. The next one will come through gangbusters in the, on the fourth beat. This one will come through like crazy. That one will come through like crazy. And, we'll, and then that one the same way. And so all of a sudden the flute, without you actually making anybody softer, is going to like pop through and there's going to be this clarity because you've made a little window for that to come through.